It is impermissible to eat such a modest amount of food while striving in the way of Allah, like in Riyazat and Mujahida, that it causes one such weakness which hinders him from fulfilling his obligatory ibadat. Like in a situation where a person eats so little and becomes so feeble due to this, that he is not able to stand up to perform his namaz. However, if he does not feel such weakness, then there is no objection to him eating such a modest amount. If one overate so that he may throw up thereafter, and this situation is beneficial for him, then there is no objection to this, as this practice is beneficial to some people. There is no objection to eating a variety of fruits together, even though it is better not to do so. If a young man fears that by eating a full stomach he will be overwhelmed by lust, then he should eat less so that he is not overwhelmed by this lust. However, he should not eat so little that it causes failure in him performing his ibadat. If only one type of food is present and this causes a person to become agitated because he is not able to fulfill his dietary requirements through this and he thus prepares a variety of food so that he may eat some of each food type and thus fulfill his dietary requirement, then there is no objection in preparing a variety of meals for this reason. If a person prepared a variety of food so that he may invite others to partake in it and none of the food will go to waste, then this too is allowed. If this is not the aim, then it is regarded as israf, being wasteful. The etiquettes and recommendations of eating are as follows. To wash the hands before eating. To wash the hands after eating. Not to wipe the hands after washing them before eating. To wipe the hands on a piece of cloth or towel after washing them after eating so that the traces of food are not left on the hand. It is sunnat to wash both the hands up to the wrists before and after eating. Some people wash only one hand or just the fingers. Some people just suffice by only washing the fingertips. This does not fulfill the recommendation of the sunnat.